This broadcast is brought to you by Scenic Productions, LLC and filled by the following. This broadcast is brought to you by Scenic Productions, LLC and filled by the following. Southeastern Baptist College, empowering students to reach their spiritual, academic, and athletic potential. Discover the difference at your hometown college. Southeastern Baptist College, equipping the saints. Having AC issues? Does your vehicle no longer drive like new? Head on over to Keys Automotive in Laurel. Keys Automotive specializes in repairing foreign and domestic vehicles. Keys Automotive, located at 623 Arco Lane in Laurel, or call Charles Keys at 601-649-0517. Hey, 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 our faithful listeners. April J. here from 93.1 WGDQ-FM. Just want to remind you of a very important day steadily approaching. It's Election Day on Tuesday, November 3rd. Election Day is very important, and this is one opportunity where you can take control for your community, not just only on a national level, but a local level as well. It's time to weigh in on issues that matter most to you and your loved ones. Our very own Mississippi native, the late Mr. Vernon Damer, said it best. If you don't vote, you don't count. That is why it is so important to go out and cast your vote. Don't forget, Tuesday, November 3rd, we want to see you at the polls. This live stream is sponsored in part by Alpha Insurance agent Ben Cole. Ben and his staff at Alpha Insurance in Ellisville is proud to serve Jones County and the Pine Belt area with excellent rates in auto, home, mobile home, business, church, and life insurance. Give Ben and his staff a call today at 601-477-4999 or visit alphainsurance.com slash Ben Cole to schedule an appointment. For the best agents in the business, call Alpha Insurance. Ben would like to thank his current customers for trusting him as their agent. And hello, NEJ Tiger fans. Thank you for logging on to this week three episode of NEJ Tiger Talk, brought to you by Scenic Productions, LLC, sponsored by Walker's Dairy Bar and fueled by Southeastern Baptist College, Alpha Insurance Agent Ben Cole, Keys Automotive Services, and Kingdom Choice Learning Center. I'm the voice of the Northeast Jones Tigers, Kinsley Keys, broadcasting live from Walker's Dairy Bar, here with my usual guest Tiger head coach, Keith Braddock, and joining him is the Senior Productions LLC Week 3 Player of the Game, sophomore linebacker quarterback, Kai Braddock. Well, Coach, how's it going? It's going well. It's going well. Glad to be here. Thank you, Kinsley. And Big Kai, how's it going, man? It's going pretty good. How about you? Doing pretty good. Well, um, Coach, let's go ahead and get into it. Well, let's start with you. Um, obviously, a disappointing loss on Friday. Um, yeah, quite an impressive performance defensively, wouldn't you say? Yeah, I thought defense played exceptionally well uh, and, and honestly defensively uh, we've, we've played well enough you know all year to uh, to win I, we knew that was going to be our, our strong point and uh, we're going to be okay on offense we've just got to got to get it rolling we knew there was going to be some growing pains we've got a we got a great coaching staff over there and they're working their behinds off and uh, and it'll come but but Yes, defensively, uh, I thought they played played minus two plays the other night. Played real well, one decent run and one decent pass play. They they played lights out. Yes, sir. I, I would definitely say that. Now, offensively, a little better consistency moving the ball versus previous weeks. Um, what do you attribute that to? Well, just getting more, uh, just getting more comfortable in the offense. Uh, you know, we're, we're 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 blocking better. We got some some personnel tweaks that we've we've, we've done moving kid here and there, moving the kids around a little bit. But uh, ju- just familiarity with the offense, just actually playing the game and, and you know, doing it for two or three weeks in a row. And it's going to get better and better. It's, it's, just, it's just a slow process, and I'm an impatient person. You know, I want it right now. But it's, uh, it's, it's getting better, and I attribute that to just playing the game. Yes, sir. Now, offensively, it seems you've shot away from um, the passing game 
um, since Charlie Strickland's injury. Are there any plans to incorporate more passing moving forward? Well, we, we got a, you know, we got a 13 year old kid playing quarterback and we're trying to do everything we can to, to, you know, put him in a situation he can be successful. But, but the passing game in the wing T offense is, is not, uh, there, there's not a lot of it. You know, it's it's usually home run plays because you, when you get to get to rolling, you usually run the ball so well, and then you have, you know, three or four shots that you take. You know, each, you know each half. I, you know, I'm not I don't know what the magic number is. How many times you want to throw it? But um, it's usually big plays when you do that. Uh, however, with, when Char when Charlie went down, uh, our main concern was, was was blocking, protecting the ball, and. Uh, and trying to uh, trying to do something with with Davin that that he was successful, he felt comfortable. Uh, but yeah, in, in, in a perfect world, we we, we realized we're gonna have to have to throw the ball some. And uh, you know, guys got some reps at, at quarterback the last couple weeks in practice. And you know, he, uh, he you know he played fullback the other night, but he, uh, he he'll probably he'll probably get some snaps at quarterback as well. Okay. Yeah. Um, now. The Tigers are back on the road um, this Thursday now, correct? Yes, it's been moved because of the hur Yes, it's been moved because of the the, uh, the hurricane coming to, to Thursday at, at Florence. Okay, glad glad you told me that this morning, Coach. That uh, I had to know that had been pretty bad. But uh, um, now, you know, like you said, they take on they hit the road this Thursday to take on the Florence Eagles. That's the team you guys defeated last season. Um, from watching film, what have you gathered about the Eagles this season? Well, offensively, they're they're very multiple. One week they they lined up in in empty, you know, empty backfield. With, you know, they'd have quads on the right, and, you know, flanker on the left. And they'd be, you know, spread three by three by one, two by two, just you know, kind of wide open. And then the next week they lined up in the overload set, and, you know, direct snap it to, to like a wildcat look and just power run right down here. So they're very very multiple offensively, um, defensively. Um, they're you know physical, good, good, good physical, athletic, athletic team. They'll they'll have some playmakers on offense. We'll have to we'll have to contend with, um, and you can usually they're they're strong in the kicking game as well. All right, well, coach, thanks so much for giving your spiel. Uh, we're gonna step away for a quick break, and when we return, we'll hear from the Senior Productions LLC Week Three. Player of the game, sophomore linebacker quarterback, Kai Braddock. Keep it locked. Kingdom Choice Learning Center, purposely created to develop leaders by incorporating biblical standards as the foundation for academic success. Southeastern Baptist College, empowering students to reach their spiritual, academic, and athletic potential. Discover the difference at your hometown college. Southeastern Baptist College, equipping the saints. This live stream is sponsored in part by Alpha Insurance agent Ben Cole. Ben and his staff at Alpha Insurance in Ellisville is proud to serve Jones County and the Pine Belt area with excellent rates in auto, home, mobile home, business, church, and life insurance. Give Ben and his staff a call today at 601-477-4999 or visit alphainsurance.com slash Ben Cole to schedule an appointment. For the best agents in the business, call Alpha Insurance. Ben would like to thank his current customers for trusting him as their agent. This is Charlie Strickland, quarterback for the Northeast Jones Tigers. Thank you for logging on to this broadcast brought to you by Cynic Productions, LLC. And welcome back to NEJ Tiger Talk, brought to you by Cynic Productions, LLC, sponsored by Walker's Dairy Bar and powered by Southeastern Baptist College, Alpha Insurance Agent Ben Cole, Keys Automotive Services, and Kingdom Choice Learning Center. Well, before the break, we heard from Tiger head coach Keith Braddock. Now we turn our attention to the Cynic Productions, LLC, Week 3 Player of the Game, Linebacker Quarterback, Kai Braddock. Well, Kai, for starters, congratulations on earning player of the game recognition. Now, um, despite the unfortunate outcome from last Friday, what are your thoughts about the Tigers' defensive performance and making some big stops causing some, and causing some turnovers? Well, first, I'd like to say thank you. And uh, defensively, I think we're pretty good. We can always get better. 
we did we did some things wrong we did a lot right and just we can always get better and this year we'll work this week we'll work even harder to get better all right now um midway through the fourth quarter um you went in that quarterback a position you um I believe you took it uh you took quite frequently last season or you took snap that snaps at the position quite frequently um so how did it how did it feel to contribute offensively for this game it felt pretty good i would i mean i was just trying to keep the team in it or get let the spark the offense up just try to help them out as easy as i can all right now i know i asked you this last season when you know you were on the show but you know, new season, different situation. But being the coach's kid, do you feel it's harder? Do you feel your dad is harder on you this season as compared to last season? Not, no, not really. It's he's always pushed me. The coaches are always push me. They always expect me to do more than what I think I can do, but they know what I can do. It's about the same every year. Oh, okay. Well, coach, what's your take on that? I don't know. I, I, have to, I look back on a lot of Saturday mornings, I have to apologize because, you know, I'm intense and he's my kid. And I, I sometimes forget he's a, you know, a sophomore and I expect so much out of him. But he, but he understands, you know, that I just love him and want him to do well. I want the kids to do well. And, uh, like I said, I, I expect him to, to be able to do everything. And, you know, he, uh, he, he, he tries. He, he does a lot for us, but, uh, you know, it, it's it's tough being a, being a dad and, 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 you know, the coach. And, you know, he plays a lot of defense. I'm kind of a defensive-minded guy, so I'm, I'm there, right there with him, you know. Uh, but but he, he handles it good. Like I said, he, he handles it good. You know, some days I, I go out there and, you know, nobody knows, and I tell myself, don't, don't say anything negative to him all day. You know, I'll tell myself just, even if he <laughs> drops the ball or misses the tackle, just today, don't say anything negative because there's a lot of times I, I ride him like a quarter horse, but it's it's just because I know his potential and I love him. And, and, and one day, then one day he'll look back when he's got a, a wife and kids and uh, goes through tough times and he'll, he'll appreciate, you know, he'll appreciate me and his, his, his mother and family, you know, pushing him and being hard on him and going through these, these, these pressure situations. You're definitely, definitely right about that, Coach. Uh, well, all right, that's going to wrap up this week's NEJ Tiger Talk. Um, thank you, Coach, and uh, thank you, Kai, for chatting with me today. Um, a special thank you to Walker's Dairy Bar for the always delicious lunch. Um, thank you to our sponsors, Southeastern Baptist College, Alpha Insurance Agent Ben Cole, Keys Automotive Services, and Kingdom Choice Learning Center. And be sure to log on to the broadcast this Thursday for the Tigers' bout against the Florence Eagles. Until then, I'm the voice of the Northeast Jones Tigers, Kinsley Keys, signing off. God bless. Hey, 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 our faithful listeners. April J here from 93.1 WGDQ FM. Just want to remind you of a very important day steadily approaching. It's Election Day on Tuesday, November 3rd. Election Day is very important, and this is one opportunity where you can take control for your community not just only on a national level, but a local level as well. It's time to weigh in on issues that matter most to you and your loved ones. Our very own Mississippi native, the late Mr. Vernon Damer, said it best. If you don't vote, you don't count. That is why it is so important to go out and cast your vote. Don't forget, Tuesday, November 3rd, we want to see you at the polls. This live stream is sponsored in part by Alpha Insurance agent Ben Cole. Ben and his staff at Alpha Insurance in Ellisville is proud to serve Jones County and the Pine Belt area with excellent rates in auto, home, mobile home, business, church, and life insurance. Give Ben and his staff a call today at 601-477-4999 or visit alphainsurance.com slash Ben Cole to schedule an appointment. For the best agents in the business, call Alpha Insurance. Ben would like to thank his current customers for trusting him as their agent. Having AC issues? Does your vehicle no longer drive like new? Head on over to Keys Automotive in Laurel. Keys Automotive specializes in repairing foreign and domestic vehicles. Keys Automotive, located at 623 Arco Lane in Laurel, 
or call Charles Keyes at 601-649-0517. Southeastern Baptist College, empowering students to reach their spiritual, academic, and athletic potential. Discover the difference at your hometown college. Southeastern Baptist College, equipping the saints.